What up, guys? I got canceled. I got canceled. I made a video and I got canceled. So I got to talk about it and we got to break some things down. We got to break some things down. So even in my rants, you're going to get some knowledge, right? Even in my rants, you're going to get some knowledge. Even in my rants, you're going to get some knowledge because they always want to cancel your boy, right? They always want to cancel. I made a video and I wore a Balenciaga hat and some Balenciaga shoes, right? And nobody seemed to like it, right? So let's talk about it because even in my rants, I'm going to give y'all some knowledge. You know I'm about to give you some free game. You know I'm about to give you some free game, right? Right? Because, listen, how many of y'all, y'all, you hate Balenciaga. If you hate Balenciaga, you shouldn't wear it. You shouldn't support it. Child, whatever. Comment. Comment. Let me know. Let me know because we got to talk about some things. We got to talk about some things. You be dropping so many gems. You already know. You know I'm about to drop some more gems. You know I'm about to drop some more gems. You hate, you hate Balenciaga, right? Comment, comment if you hate Balenciaga. Comment, because we got to talk about it. We got to talk about it. Don't support them. You shouldn't, right? You shouldn't. <laughs> they canceling me because I made a video wearing a Balenciaga hat. So we got to talk about it. Let's break down history. Let's break down some, let's break down some things. You can't stand them. Look, you're angry. You, you hate. As soon, soon as I pull out the Balenciagas, I hate them. There you go. E-Money. You hate them. You hate them. And this is going to be uploaded on YouTube. This is an important talk. Right? You can't stand them. They're, they're crazy. Right? Not a big fan. You, it, it makes you sick. So, if you want to cancel me, because I just so happen to come into some success, so I have some money to buy more expensive products than most people. Right? Right? So, if you want to cancel me, because I like to wear Balenciaga because of their child history. I hate them. Nish. You hate them. Nish. I'm going to get back to you. All y'all who say you hate them. We're going to talk about it, right? Because if you hate me and you want to cancel me and you don't like me, I'm going to unfollow you. Ugh, why are you wearing Balenciaga? Child this, child that, right? Everybody says that. Everybody says that. But then, hold up. Everybody says that, but then they go, but then they go stand in line for the Nikes. Off of, which is, which is child slavery in the sweatshops. The tank top I'm wearing right now. Pretty sure. It was made by some kids in a sweatshop. You follow me? Expensive does not mean fly. You are 100% correct. It's all about how you dress, how you wear, everything. You are 100% correct. You are 100% correct. That is not the point. The point is, people are picking, you pick and choose. You wear your Jordans, you wear your Nikes, you send little Timmy, you watch him at his game, and he wears his Pumas and his Adidas. Let me see. He wears his Puma, he wears his Pumas, and his Adidas made by Hitler's homies. You got your Pumas and your Hitler and your Hitler, your Hitler Tins on. You got your Hitler Tins on. It's not the same. Okay. So trafficking is not the same. This is the crazy thing. People pick and choose. Trafficking is not as bad as the iPhone that I'm holding in my hands and the and the MacBook and the tablet that me and my children play on that is made by kids in modern day slavery in Congo in horrible living conditions, literally in slavery this day. We don't say nothing about that. When I walk past the, when I go to the mall in the iPhone store, nobody's protesting. Nobody cares that all the products in there are made by little African kids to this day, to this day, to this day, getting paid nothing. Nobody cares about the iPhone, the MacBook, the, the tablets. Nobody cares about the Nikes being made by little kids in slavery. Everybody cares about the kids when you pull out the Balenciagas, right? Nobody cares about the Hershey bar, the Nesquik, the chocolate that you're consuming. Nobody cares about the chocolate you're consuming, which is made by modern day slavery, right? The kids in Africa right now not getting paid. If they are getting paid anything, less than a dollar per month. <laughs> Nobody cares about them climbing up in the trees, sweating, them having no working water and picking the cacao for you just to ship it off in bags to Hershey, to Nestle, to all our chocolate factories, but you have no problem. When you go through that drop, when you go, when you checking out and you, and you see that Hershey, you're like, mm, they got the new, the peanut butter Snickers. Let me throw that, just throw it in the bag. Uh, uh. Ooh, the Nike. Ooh, let me get those. Ooh, the new Kyrie's. Ooh, well, they canceled them because of that. Oh, well, let me get the new KD's then. Or let me get the John Murray. Well, they canceled him because he likes getting a lot of dances. Well, hello. <laughs> Or the Ford you like to drive. Or the BMW, the fresh BMW that you just upgraded your life and got, right? 
You just got the BMW. You know the BMW is made by racist Hitler's homies too, right? You know this, right? You know the Fanta sodas? That's the Nazi party also. You know that, right? You know that, right? You know that, right? Oh. Oh, that, that ain't... It's not the same. The Balenciagas is worse because they're messing with kids in this way. We don't really care about the kids that's dying every single day. The hundreds of thousands of kids dying and getting in literally in slavery. You know, we watch the slavery documentaries and we cry. And we say, I can't believe they did that to the people. I can't believe that's how our ancestors used to be or white people or other ethnic. I can't believe they did that to that whole race. But anyways, I don't know. I don't care about that. Are you following me? You follow me? Somebody comment, free game. But when you pull out the Balenciagas, everybody unfollow. I'm unfollowing him. I'm unfollow. So when you unfollow me for wearing Balenciaga, all right, or whatever, all these Gucci's. Gucci's is on about Balenciaga. So I'm sure, I'm sure they did something. Oh yeah, they put the, the monkeys on the front of the shirts. So now it's some of the biggest protests, racist. We don't, we're not, we don't buy Gucci because they're, they're racist. Buy Puma and Adidas instead, made by Hitler's homies. And drive the BMW, made by Hitler's homies. Don't buy the Gucci, because I got the baby had the nerve. I can't believe they put the monkeys on the sweater. They are so racist. Why would you ever support them? Go buy the new Yeezys, who is a company made by Hitler's homies. Buy the BMWs, buy the Fords. My Ford Focus, my 2005 Ford Focus. <laughs> that one's fine. Don't you dare try to go past the Apple store that's packed shoulder to shoulder. I don't know what people are doing in the Apple store, by the way. I don't know what people are doing in the Apple store, by the way. Why is it always packed? Right? But anyway, you go past the Apple store, that ain't nothing but the products made by little African kids. To this day. But nobody cares. We pick and choose. And it seems like we seem to, to sway the pendulum towards stuff that's more expensive than we can afford. That's how it seems. It seems like we like hate people that get money. That's that's what I that's that's what it seems like. I don't know though. I don't know. But I did this rant. This man is cooking, right? You all in love with the iPhones. Please don't do this. You're gonna lose all respect. When we know better, we do better. You're comparing what are you saying? You're comparing this. The whole game is trash. Exactly. So off of that point. Unless you are about to live in the jungle and make you a little skirt made of leaves, right? Then don't come at me about what I'm wearing. Worried about what you put on your son this morning. Worried about the t-shirt you got from JCPenney's and the Sears in the, in the mall and the tank top you ordered on Amazon and the Nikes that you put on your son before he went to his rec league game and worry about your Pumas that you're wearing and worry about the Ford that you're driving to work and worry about the BMW you've been saving up for. And then come comment on my videos and tell me to take off my Balenciaga. Cool? Is that cool? Somebody comment, cool. Which, oh, by the way, actually, you can't even do that because you wouldn't be able to do that because you would have had to throw your phone out, your MacBook, your iPhone. The whole point is, let's be real, people. This whole world is sick and disgusting. Let's acknowledge that. No matter what route we go, again, unless we about to go back to the, unless we about to go really live off of the, off of the earth and keep your mouth shut, right? Keep your mouth. Put the zipper emojis. You know the zipper emojis? T-Walk speaking the truth, right? Right? Right. It's not about cool. It's about what you want to wear. A lot of the stuff I wear is cheap as hell. I get most of my stuff off Amazon. But I do like shades, right? But again, Gucci done did something wrong, I'm sure. Versace, Versace, I'm sure, did something wrong. I'm sure Versace did something wrong. So throw those out. Ball main, I'm sure they're owned by a company that's owned by a company that's owned by a company that did something wrong. So let me throw these out. The Balenciagas, throw those out. But then what about my, my LeBrons? I got to throw those out too? Damn, what about the phone? I talk, I can't go live and give y'all a free game anymore. I can't make videos. I got I to gotta throw the phone out too. Oh man, my, actually all my glasses are sitting on top of my, my MacBook. I got to throw that out too. Oh man, I do... See, some, I'm, I'm alkaline, but every now and then, if I do crave chocolate, chocolate, I eat cacao as like a substitute, but I can't eat that either because that's made by child slaves. And all the electronics are made by child slaves. 
So therefore, I can't do anything. Right? LeBron satanic. See, LeBron done did something too. LeBron satanic. There's something wrong with everything. So, what are you going to do about it? Are you going to pick and choose on what you're going to protest? Are you going to pick and choose? Or are you going to go live in a bush, butt naked? I don't think you're going to do that, right? So why are you trying to act like an activist? Why all of a sudden you're an activist when the Balenciaga come out while you got Nikes on your feet? Dude made a, dude made a comment said, you shouldn't be... He made a comment and said, you shouldn't be wearing... I get these all the time. You shouldn't be... I can't believe you're wearing Balenciaga. I respected you so much. And I clicked his profile picture and he had a Nike t-shirt on and all his video, all his photos on his page was nothing but Nikes. And he's a shoe collector. <laughs> Which is made by... Child slaves, right? So what are we talking about? And in the video, I was actually standing in front of the I-8. I was standing in front of I-8 with the Balenciaga hat on, and he called out the Balenciaga hat. I can't believe you're supporting them. And I wrote back and I said, well, you forgot to call out the I-8 that's behind me because that's a BMW and that's made by Hitler's people. The Nazis, that's where I came from. So make sure you don't forget that too. Don't forget that either, right? Yeah, you got that's all you can put is that little splash face emoji. Just, shit, he's right. You can't tell me I'm wrong. You can't tell me I'm wrong. You can't tell me I'm wrong. Am I wrong? Somebody tell me I'm wrong. Somebody tell me I'm wrong and improve it. Yeah, if you ain't living off the grid, then shut your face. Something about your, something about your face just really bothers me. I just want to, I just want to punch it like just just shut shut your face yeah i don't see anybody saying i'm wrong because i'm not it's all facts right somebody comment all facts nah only facts right all the activists is quiet now once i bring up the nikes the pumas the adidas the bmw the ford the chocolate that they eat every single brand all the activists that hate this hat they're quiet now oh where are you at huh if you're watching this replay on youtube click that thumbs up somebody comment free game somebody comment Pay attention. All the people who won't follow me because of this. Congratulations. You just missed out on a ton of free game and now I'll take a change and save your life. All because you're being judgmental and worried about what I'm wearing. Why are you wearing the same stuff? Like Shorty earlier said, it's not the same. Tell me how it's not the same. Tell me how you're so against Balenciaga because what they're doing to children. And explain to me how that's not... That's worse... Then the little kids and their moms in the Congo with them on their back that is dying every single day. And that's worse than supporting these companies made by Hitler, which killed a lot of people. And that's worse than the modern day slavery with the chocolate. And that's worse than what they're doing with Nike and the little Asian kids in the sweatshops. And that's worse. Tell me how it's worse. It's not supposed to be funny, but you're laughing hard, you know, because I, I got to. All we can do, this is why I teach the way I teach. When I talk about food, it's unhealthy. Pay attention. It's causing disease. Pay attention. This causes cancer. Pay attention. This causes diabetes. Pay attention. And then I make a joke, right? Or I talk about racism and what they're doing to children. And I make a joke. Because all we can do, we gotta, we just got to laugh it off. There's, there's nothing. It's not going to stop. It's not going to stop. And I understand you want to, I get it from a serious note, I understand you want to support. You want to be against Balenciaga because they publicized that and they chose to hype that up. And you want to, you want to do something about it, right? Only to realize you are still sleeping. Don't realize that while you're Balenciaga, we hate Balenci, we hate Balenci. You got a Nike t-shirt on or you got this tank top that was probably made by a little 12 year old little Asian kid that I wore off Amazon, right? Disney, then you go to Disney, then you go to all the amusement parks, you go to Universal. Well, I'm not going to Disney, I'm going to Universal. <laughs> all you can do is put the little splash emoji, put the little, the little melting splash emoji, all right? I get it, trust me, I get it. But one day you gotta wake up and face the reality and realize unless you're living off the grid, you are supporting something that is sick and disgusting and wrong. Because us as humans, unfortunately, we have grown to a point where people got too much money or crave too much money and they got they end up doing some sick stuff to get more, to keep more of us in poverty so that they can live lavish 
lives. So therefore, life is short and I'm going to wear what I want to wear because no matter what I choose is wrong, right? I'm going to focus on bringing positive energy to the world instead of every time I see a rapper's video, I don't listen to him anymore. He's wearing Jordan. Don't listen to him anymore. He's wearing Gucci. Don't listen to him anymore. Because that's not really doing anything because you did that while holding your phone. You typed on your phone made from the from the from the modern day slavery of the blacks just like just like back in the day where they've been doing it to us right it ain't it ain't changed it ain't changed you know it ain't changed right you know it ain't changed right and then people say well no I make my own clothing I make my own clothing that's why you gotta make your own clothing get on Teespring and just put your own logo on it and get your t-shirts in bulk, the bulk t-shirts, the 50, the 100 t-shirts that you bought at the time that was still made by them a little Asian kids in the sweatshop. You still lose. You still lost. You still support it. Hurting children and doing children dirty or some sort of slavery. Nice try. That was an amazing try. That was an amazing effort. I see what you did. You tried though. I appreciate it. I appreciate you trying. But guess what? You failed again. It'll never change. Jay Z's on. Never, 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 never change. I never, they never change. They too stuck in their way. Never change. Oh, I never change. Never, 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 never change. You following me, right? Where, where everybody at? Where was, where was all. Huh? Huh? Yeah, where's where's everybody at now? Cause when it, when we came in, it was like two hundred in here, and everybody was like, yeah, fuck, fuck. and now I don't see anybody saying I'm wrong. Huh? All of a sudden, I must be right. Must be right now, right? Must be right now, right? Huh? Oh, somebody has a somebody has a trick. Okay, let me see who's got a trick. No, not accurate, my brother. I wore it all, but God opened your, opened your understandings. Then you have knowledge to search before you wear. Okay. Tell me how far you get with that and tell me how big that, that, that gets. Tell me, how, tell me how you blow that one up. Good luck. You're doing amazing. And while you, while you wrote that really, that really philanthropic, you wrote that really nice message about how you figured out how to control your clothes. And now you're doing better because God opened your eyes. One, one Marable, Marable's fitness, however you say it, you know, I can't read. But since you figured it out, remember, you wrote that long paragraph on a phone made by child slavery, actually, and adult slavery in Africa. Remember that. So I, I see what you did there. You wrote a really, like, nice paragraph that made it, you figured out the clothing. Everything I'm saying is wrong. You got to figure it out. But the way you spread that message that you figured it out, you spread it by still utilizing the black slaves, the Africans right now that are literally, while I'm speaking, there are thousands of African people right now digging in the mountains so that I can use this phone and so they can make, make the iPhone 15, the MacBook Pro Plus 72, the Tesla. The you got to get Tesla. We need to talk about Tesla. You got to get a Tesla, because that's good for the environment. I love you that much. Thank you, Tesla, for doing something so great for the world. Thank you, Tesla, the savior. Stop using gasoline cars and messing with the environment, because that's going to end our existence. Get a Tesla, which runs off of the cobalt from the modern-day slavery in Africa right now and the people that are out there plowing in the mountains right now and dying as I speak. So that you can drive your Tesla, which is saving the environment. <laughs> I love Tesla. <laughs> Tesla's amazing. Oh, well, damn, that didn't work either. Nice try, Elon. You failed too. And you actually made it worse. It's getting uncomfortable. I'm actually sweating. It's a little, I'm just going to, dang, my whole closet. I got to, I got to toss it off. I got to toss it off. Shit. What am I going to do? 
I gotta toss it up. I gotta be a good person. I gotta toss it all. I gotta toss it all. Oh my goodness. The Fords, the BMWs, the Teslas ain't good. I thought that was saving the planet. Oh no, it killed more people. Oh, the Teslas killed more people. Oh. Oh shit. Damn. Look, I'm so amped up. I done drooled all over the MacBook. I done drooled all over the MacBook that was created by the slaves. Damn. Yeah, if you don't know what you walked into, you got to watch this. This replay will be uploaded on my YouTube channel, youtube.com slash twalkthawk. Oh, my goodness. By golly, G. Willikers. Damn, I really thought Tesla was really out here saving the world and stuff. I ain't even know until I watched T-Walks Live. I ain't even know the chocolate, the Hershey bars, the tank tops, every brand of shoe, every company, the phone. I didn't even know it was all made off of modern day slavery or owned by some people who were best friends with Hitler or, or made by someone who's exploiting children. Or And then you go on, you go on your favorite XXX site and the most popular the most popular, y'all ready? The most popular search topic on your favorite XX sites is teens, 18 year olds. 18 year old gets plowed by BBZ. Eight, little 18 year old rides Johnny Johnson. And you don't even realize that most of them 18 year olds is just Little girls is like 15, 16 and mature early and they get them for the low and then they throw them in a video and just label it as 18 year old. They put them on drugs and everything else. Oh, you're sick. Oh, you're disgusting. That's the top search engine when it comes to XXX videos is 18 year olds, 18 year old girl. And you don't realize that most of them you're watching is 16, 15. Oh, you're just, oh, this world is sick. Shit just got real weird. It just keeps getting weirder and wilder. Getting weirder, and weirder. I'm melting. I'm melting. I'm melting. <gasps> Shit just got weird. She just got weird. She just got real weird. Preteens at best. Preteens at best. Riding 30 year olds. Imagine that. And you got that in your favorites. That's in your save bar. That's in your account. You created a login and everything. You got a whole. You got a whole category in your XXX site titled My Favorite 18 Year Old Videos. Anyways, anyways, hey Wiz, you joined late. I just went in. My homie Wiz is joined. I'm sweating right now. I had to. <laughs> Shit's getting real creepy, right? All I see is facts. All you can put is the melting face. At this point, all you can put is the. <sighs> How they say that? Protect this man at all costs. Free game! You're sick. We're all sick. We're all sick. No matter what we're doing, we're doing something that's slightly sick. Damn. 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 Damn, homie. Damn. Yo. And still, I see no changes. Tupac been telling us. Do -do -do, do -do -do, do -do -do. That's just the way it is. When it is. Yeah. Ain't gonna never be the same. Now we can say, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. That's just the way it is. Oh, yeah. Hear me now. Sheesh. I got love for my brothers, but we can never go nowhere unless we share it with each other. It's time to start me making changes. Learn to see me as your brother to the do distant strangers. Because that's how it's supposed to be. Yeah, you know, it all sounds... I get it. I get it. I get it. We want to try. If you're just joining, we broke down. We started from Balenciaga and how I get attacked for wearing this. Let me get some more free game. Let me get some more free game. Here's some more forget. We started off with Balenciaga around my neck and how I get attacked for it. And then I had to break down history in which you're all supporting, right? You know, and by the way, 
This Balenciaga hat, this joint fake as hell. This joint was $10. I could have bought the real one for $500, but I bought the fake one for $10. And whether it was the real one or the fake one, it still was made by little Asian kids in sweatshops. So I didn't do any better. Now, the shoes is real. And it really doesn't matter if you're rocking a $10 fake Balenciaga hat when you hop out of a McLaren, which is $200,000 plus car. Nobody's really going to question it, so I get like a little leeway. But I'm just going to keep it real with you. But even though it's the fake one, and these ones is the real ones, I still lose. I still participate. It's doing ten dollars. I could have got. The, I said, hold up. I was in. I was in uh, DR. I went. To, I walked. I was on a resort, and I looked to the right. I seen Balenciaga. Hat. I seen a. I seen a Christian Dior hat. I said, I know they ain't got no real. So let me see. I'm like, look. All right. Let me Google the real one. It looks exactly the same. The Dior one looks exactly the same. Except this one's ten dollars. The Dior hat was fifty. But if I bought the real Dior, it was seven hundred and fifty dollars. If I bought the real Balenciaga hat, it was five hundred and fifty dollars. So I said, let me get the fake Balenciaga. <laughs> Let me get the fake Dior. I pay sixty dollars total instead of getting both and paying thirteen hundred dollars total. And either way, I still participated in supporting child slavery. <laughs> I gotta go. This replay will be up on my YouTube channel. Yeah, you know Dior to plug. <laughs> Dior to plug. Hey, this replay will be up on my YouTube channel. All y'all subscribe to my YouTube. I joke a lot. I know. Real talk. It's sad. It's disgusting. I bring comedy to it to try to lighten what's really going on, but it is what it is. Uh, yeah, subscribe to my YouTube channel. My name's the same, T Walk the Hawk. Thanks, God. We about to hit like 30,000 subscribers on there. The replay will be up because you need to share this slav with some people to get them to stop being judgmental, but also to make them understand what's really going on in the world and how sick this world actually is. I'm sure this video is not going to, I don't know. I hope it don't get taken down by YouTube because I did say a lot of things. Uh, I'm going to go. Do you know my phrase? Do what you got to do. Do what you got to do because it's that simple. I don't believe in if, try, can, almost, or maybe I get it done. No excuses, nothing to it but to do it. Point your finger in the mirror if you blow it. I usually focus on health and I focus on making sure I'm on a holistic mission of self-healing and I can't deny I won't even lie. It's the best feeling and all that. But today I wanted to talk about some other things that I felt needed to be publicized. But I'm still on a holistic mission of self-healing. Links in the bio for whatever you need to change your life. Detailed protocols for every single disease and illness in my Holistic Health University. So you can no longer have these illnesses. Get off of these pills. Get off of this trash. Improve your life the best that you can. Do the best that you can. But yeah. Self-healing is the best feeling, right? You wouldn't know because you don't know why you ain't feeling right. It's probably because your acidity is on infinity. pH lower than Cinco, but they ain't feeling me. So let me slow it up. Trade acidic junk for alkaline food and watch your pH levels going up. Don't bring a knife to a gunfight. You don't need prescription pills. Just need some herbs with some sunlight. With a plant-based diet, yeah, you should try it. T. Walker have you feeling brand new. You can't deny it. You ever heard of Sarsha Barilla, Burdock, Seamoss, you are my top picks from the herb shop. Bladder rack, yellow dot with some stinging nettle. Come on, it's time to detox from all these heavy metals. Let's start treating your body like a temple. The holistic God, do what you got to do. It's simple, you know? But the problem is nobody wanting divine ascension, but I'm going to teach you healthy living. Just got to pay attention. No, you ain't an offer them pills and not to mention being there for your family. So come on, now let's go and get it. Uh, but you don't know about herbs. All you know is about issues. You don't know about crystals. You don't know about positive affirmations in the places they'll take you. The system's set up to break you. Let's get escape in the matrix. I'm sick of the hatred. I'm out.